Hi, I'm Brent. Today we've got a video update for you on the Subaru LeVorg. Now, we've spoken about the ways of improving the handling of your Subaru LeVorg, but now we're going to actually show you some of the advanced updates that is becoming available from a performance point of view specific to the suspension components. And we're going to talk about improving the stiffness of the geometry of the suspension. And what I'm going to show you in the next five minutes of just how you can do that with some relatively low cost parts. And we're talking about the way the suspension moves independently of the body to reduce noise vehicle harshness, or what some people call NVH. So what you've got to understand is when a manufacturer builds a car, it's a big compromise between reducing the road noise that you hear when you're driving down the road versus at the same time having the suspension firmly located in position so you don't get excessive tyre wear or the car doesn't feel like a big bowl of jelly. So on the really big boulevard type cruisy vehicles, the old type of Cadillacs and things like that, got very squishy soft suspension, very, very easy and nice to drive down the road. But when you push the car around the corner, everything tends to move and distort and it's not really what you would call a crisp handling car. So you go to complete opposite, say for example a Formula One car, everything's got um, really accurate rose joints, um, heaps of accuracy in the way things are tied into place, huge amounts of NVH, very, very sharp to turn, and the way the car accelerates and puts its power to the ground. Well, somewhere in between that, the manufacturer has to choose a compromise. And on a Subaru LeVorg, it may be a little bit different to a WRX, which may be different to a GT. So what we're gonna show you now is, on the back suspension, which is similar and very, uh, um, similar to a WRX, you've got the whole rear suspension assembly mounted on four main points that are bolted to this, the actual body of the car. And as you can see in this situation, there is a, an infill bush, which I'll, looks like that when it's not fitted in there. And if you imagine this part of the urethane fills the void of the bush that Subaru has designed that allows the suspension to move a little bit under forward and sideways loading. Now, of course, as you accelerate and decelerate, these things move a little bit, and also sideways loading as well. So if you want to improve the actual accuracy of your suspension location to the body and improve the sharpness, these are some of the things that you can replace the whole bush, or you can go the easy way and put an infill bush in there, which then replaces the void so when things go to move, this closes up the gaps in those voids and then stops the suspension moving around. So what I want to show you is we've got this one here, which is hasn't been pushed all the way in yet. There's another bush at the top, which does it from the top. And then we'll come around here and you can see this front mounted bush here, which is a similar situation because of the four points. So you've got the front one, the rear one, and then the, obviously the opposite side as well. And these are just some of the components that locate the rear suspension on your Subaru LeVorg. And interestingly, on this particular model, I can tell you they're identical to the Subaru WRX. So whether you've got the LeVorg with the Bilsteins or non-Bilstein, from what we can work out so far, the voiding and the mechanical locating of the rear suspension mounts is identical to the WRX. And these parts are, can be purchased quite easily um, from our website. Again, put in the uh, search feature of LeVorg um, and you go to your year, make and model and you can find these parts allocated specifically against your model. And of course, you can follow our other video and YouTube updates for other ways to improve your LeVorg. And I'll take some still photos of these parts just so you can refer to them as well. Hopefully this has helped you improve the suspension and handling of your LeVorg wherever you are in the world. I'm Brett Middleton. I hope to update you again soon. Bye for now.